Hello friends, in this video I will show you how to get all the files of any particular extension from a given folder. Uh, here I will be showing you how to get dot all the dot png images from this folder, the zero folder. Now this zero folder contains many different folders. These are all my Android projects and they contain many different subfolders in which there is drawable and each drawable contains these PNG images. So here I will show you how to get all the PNG images together in a list in Sketchware. So let's start. I'll just note the name of this folder. It is zero folder with F in capital. So here I have a list view in, on the main page. And this is a custom list view for which custom view is unit.xml. The unit.xml contains an image view with width match parent and scale type fit center. Now moving back to main.xml. Here I do not have any components and I have created these number variables n and r and two string variables folder and folder name and I've created three lists a string list called folder list another string list called file list and a list map called image list I've added two string list and one list map then I've added two more blocks one is get file list in some string and search folders. So here I use this get file list in and here I have entered my folder name get external storage directory and slash I can write any folder name there. So here I will show you how I define this get file list. Here, I, this file path will be the folder name which we specify. So first I get all the files in this folder to a list string called file list. So this file list will contain all the files and folder in this file path. So suppose this file path is zero folder, then it will contain all these folders plus all these files. So this will be the contents of file list. Now after that I scan this file list for that I set the number variable to number variable n to 0 and then for the length of this file list I repeat if path at that position of file list is file then I check if it ends with dot here I am checking for png file so I will just convert it to dot png so if the file name ends with dot png then I add that file path get at n of file list this is the file path so I add that to image list which is a list map using this key image and later I will retrieve it and show it in an image view and if it is a directory if the file path is a directory then I add it to a list string called folder list and then I increase the number variable n by 1 so that next time it repeats it repeats it for a different file or folder and after that once this repeat block is complete I search folders here I have created folder list so I will just search them for that I have created a more block called search folders So here, this is how I search folders. Here I increase the number variable r by 1. Initially the number variable r is 0. And in onCreate also I have set this number variable r to 0. So initially I increase the number variable r by 1. Then I check if r is less than the length of folder list plus 1. If it is less than length of folder list plus 1. Then I set the string variable folder to 
get at r minus 1 of list string folder list. So, this will be the complete path of that folder from folder list. So, I will get a, a single position from that folder list to the string variable folder. Then I set folder name to get, get last segment path of folder substring 0 to length of folder minus 1. Actually, the length any path of any folder contains a slash, this slash symbol at the end. So, in order to remove that, I have used folder substring 0 to length of folder minus 1. So, it will remove the last character and then I get the folder name by using get last segment path of and after that I check, I convert the folder name to lowercase and check if it starts with sys. Since I do not want to scan the system folder, I just check if it starts with sys. If it starts with sys, then I search folders again. Search folders means I will increase the number variable r by 1 and then it will repeat all the complete process for a different folder. And if it does not start with sys, then I check if it starts with a dot. I do not want to scan folders with starts with dot. That is why I add this. If it starts with dot, I search folders. Means I increase number variable r by 1 and search for the next folder. And if it does not start with dot, then I use get file list in get at r minus 1 of list string folder list. So, this means I scan for that folder using this get file list. So, it will be kind of loop and it will scan all the folders in the particular folder which we enter here in place of file path. So, here in on create, since I want to search for 0 folder, I have added get external storage directory which is my SD card and slash after that 0 folder. This is name of my folder and after that this slash. This will scan for this folder and before this I clear the folder list and image list and then I display it in a display this image list in list view 1. And for displaying it in list view 1, I have this on bind custom view. Here I set image of image view 1 to image view 1, set image from file path, get value at position, key image of list map, image list. So, this will display all the dot png images. Here I have mentioned dot png. So, it will get a list of all dot png images to the list. Now, let us check this. So, here it takes some time initially and then it lists all the images in this 0 folder. So, here I have all these images in the 0 folder, all the images from 0 folder. Now, if I want to scan the complete SD card, then also I can use this same code, but that will take a lot of time and running it on the main UI thread is difficult. It will crash the app, hang the app and it will cause other problems. So, in next video I will show you how to do it in background. So, that is all in this video. Thank you very much for watching this.